Hello friends, welcome to your channel The Zero Math. The Three Runners puzzle is the famous puzzle taken from the Indian Civil Service Examinations. The puzzle is, there are three runners X, Y and Z who competes in 1000 meter race. Each runner runs with different uniform speed. If X and Y are competing, then X gives Y a start of 50 meters so that they will finish the race at the same time. If X and Z are competing, then X gives Z a start of 69 meters so that X and Z will finish the race in the same time. The puzzle is, if Y and Z are competing each other, then how much start should Y give to Z so that both of them can finish the race at the same time? We highly recommend to take a pause of minute or so to give this problem a try. Before we get into the solution, let me tell you that most of the people will give answer of this puzzle as 19 meter because x gives y a start of 50 meter and x gives z a start of 69 meters. Hence, if we compare y and z, there is a difference of 19 meter. However, this is the wrong answer. This answer is wrong because y is running the distance of 950 meters and we have to give the answer for 1000 meter race. This is the catch. Let's try to figure out the answer now. We know the formula distance is equal to speed into time, where speed is represented by letter s and time is represented by letter t. Let's represent the speed of runners x, y and z in lowercase letter x, y and z respectively. The x is running the 1000 meter race. Hence, by the formula, distance is equal to speed into time, 1000 is equal to x times t. Similarly, y is running the 950 meter race. Hence, 950 is equal to y times t. And z is running the 931 meter race. Hence, we can write down the equation 931 is equal to z times t. If we compare x and y, we can write down the equation t is equal to 1000 over x which is equal to 950 over y. Hence y is equal to 950 over 1000 times x. Hence y is equal to 0.95 x. Similarly, we can write down another equation for comparing x and z. t is equal to 1000 over x which is equal to 931 over z. Hence z is equal to 931 over 1000 times x. Hence z is equal to 0.931 times x. Now let's solve equation 1 and 2 to find out the relation between y and z. Let's divide equation 2 by equation 1. We will get z over y is equal to 0.931x by 0.95x. Let's cancel out x from the numerator as well as denominator. We will get z over y is equal to 0.98. We can further simplify this equation as z over y is equal to 980 over 1000. Let's rewrite this equation in form of time t, where z and y is a speed and 980 and 1000 is a distance covered. We can rewrite it as z over 980 is equal to y over 1000, which is equal to t, that is the time taken. Which means if y runs 1000 meter in the same time z runs 980 meter. Hence, y has to give a start of 1000 minus 980 which is equal to 20 meters to z so that both will finish the race in the same time. Friends, I hope you like this tricky math puzzle. Please do not forget to subscribe our channel and keep in touch with us for more videos like this. Thank you.